Hello everyone. Today we shall look into natural inner join and natural left outer join functions. Natural inner join function it performs an inner join of a table with another table. The tables are joined on common columns in the two tables. If the two tables have no common columns, an error is returned. There is no sort order guarantee for the results. Columns being joined on must have the same data type in the data tables. This function is not supported for use in direct query mode when it is used in calculated columns or low level security rules. Similar to the inner join, the other conditions are applicable, but the only difference is in natural left outer join, all the rows from the left table are uh, populated and only matching rows from the right table are populated. Okay, this, are, this is the major difference between inner join and uh, left outer join, where inner join performs only the ro rows where both has the common matching you know ids in natural left outer join all the rows of left table are obtained and only the matching rows of right table are obtained let us see in action how it works here i have department table where i have three different departments and their respective ids and here i have my employee table where i have five different employees and uh, these are the respective departments Suppose that I want to make inner join, I will create a new table. I will write inner join table equal to natural inner join. In the left table, I will write employee and in the right table, I will write department. I will close the parenthesis and hit enter. Here you could notice that in the employee table, we get only three employees because the other the other two employees, their department is not available. Hence, in inner join, only matching rows will be populated. This is how we do inner join in the DAX. Let us uh, understand how natural left outer join is performed. I'll write left outer join equal to natural left outer join. In the left table, I'll provide employee and in the right table, I'll provide department. I'll close the parenthesis and hit enter. Here you could notice that left table uh, rows, all rows are available and only matching rows of right table are available. The two rows of uh, employees, Harry and Anthony, the data department ID is not available in the department table. Hence, we get the blank values. This is how we perform left outer join using natural left outer join. Suppose that we want right outer join. We don't have any other new function. We use the same function and we just interchange the tables. I'll show you how it works. I'm creating a new table. I'll write right outer join equal to natural left outer join. Instead of employee table, I'll give department table and in the right table, I'll provide employee table. I'll commit. Here you could notice that I have my right table present where all the rows of right right table are present and in the left table I have only the employees where department IDs are available. This is all about the natural inner join and natural left outer join functions. Thank you for watching and we shall meet in the next video.